Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of The Walking Dead. Let's see, right now we're looking for David's car, or his truck. It's not in the pathway. It's this way. They ran all, yeah, they ran over all the walkers. to hit too many. There he is. Oh my god. Poor David. Poor Gabe. I can't imagine. Gabe's come a long way. He's really grown. Did he really need to learn this lesson, though? Not at all. He talked about this every day. What to do when he died. He was convinced it would happen in the field. Every day. As common as talking about the weather. Not surprising. He was a soldier. I used to hate talking about it. But it seemed to soothe him. Maybe because he thought it was all He'd in order. He'd talk about his military funeral the way that other people talked about retirement plans. He'd only change the subject if I promised I'd bury these. He didn't care about burying his body. As far as he was concerned, this was him. Help me dig. It doesn't have to be much. Okay. I'm happy you were at least, you know... He was a jerk and tried to kill me, but at least, you know, at the in the end, I gave him the respect he deserved at the, you know, his passing. We should probably say something. That's what you do, usually. I'm gonna keep watching out for Gabe. We'll take care of each other. Do you, uh, you want to say something? Let's go. Oh. Should have buried that with him, with the dog tags. So did Joan ever survive? I'm curious. We got Trip. Oh wow, we got Mariana. We got Dr. Lingard. A lot of people I don't know and maybe I did do know. Oh, we're gonna place a photo of David. Okay. Do we even have a photo of David? Oh, look at that. It was his own fault. If you regret helping me, if you're feeling helping you. any guilt, bury it. I mean it. You're right. He dug his own grave. Absolutely. Okay, now it's time to heal. Does that mean we 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 saved Richmond? Because three days later. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than than I ever did in an old van on streets with no street lights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. 
a fresh start. What do you say? I think <laughs> it'd be good for us. Uh, okay, let's Iran. do it. <laughs> let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside well, it. Well, I think be part of your family should be Clem and Gabe. It so long be. as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. We'll be up there before we know it. Better That's do something depressing. worthwhile in the meantime. We also got to go save AJ now that we know where he is. Or did Clem leave and go do that? Because you better not let her do that. Okay. Looking pretty good. I gotta go find Clem or something. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. I gotta admit, man, you're a fucking badass. <laughs> you're a real charmer. <laughs> you know that? Through and through. Oh, you know what they say. Takes one to know one. <laughs> that they do. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust yeah. me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Yeah. Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. So who's taking over leadership Good to here? Good hear. I read people pretty well. A little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. So I'm assuming Joan is dead. Hey, uh, Jesus? Hey, uh, Gabe. Thanks for, you know, not letting me get killed and for coming back to help us. Yeah, thanks for that, man. Pay it forward. <laughs> Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away. Yep. There she is. You're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ Javi. Yeah. I've waited so long. Why can't I help her? I don't get Could that. Could you do me one last favor before I leave? Of course. <laughs> Am I cutting her hair? <laughs> I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought it was oh terrible. Goodness, look at her hair without hey, without, without the hat. Not your business. I'm really gonna miss Gabe. I oh. mean, he's super annoying sometimes, but I've gotten used to having him around. At least to have someone to talk to, even if he is a total dork. Not that he said anything to me in particular, but. You know the guy's got a Mondo crush on you, right? <laughs> he does not. Yes. Oh my gosh, you have a crush on him, too. I do not. Well, you both have my blessing. Uh, I'm going to stab you with those scissors. That's <laughs> that's amazing. Can we wash the hat, Clem? There's still blood on it. I have to see it. AJ Javi. Yeah. I have to see that he's okay. That's no problem. Just get him and come back. Do you think he remembers me? How could he not? At least a little. Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. See? Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. No. 
I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep, that's true. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? That's what's good about a broken heart. When you're looking at it all broken and shattered on the floor, and you figure out the pieces you need versus the ones you liked. Yep. If you're ready to move on, that is. If. I think you'll be okay. All done. Well, so. <laughs> how's it look? Oh, it looks nice. That should you look really what? cool. I'll grab your hat. No, it looks good, Clem. It's a style. <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's she a looks deal. great. What's the problem? If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? Of course. You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. I believe in her. Look at that, she got a little leather jacket now. <laughs> Aw, that's sweet. Not gonna give me a hug? What? How dare you, Chloe? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Wait, she doesn't have any supplies or anything? We couldn't set her up for at least a little bit. Wow. So for some reason, I finally, I guess I got my, my choices. Your experience with David was dysfunctional. Okay, you accepted David's hand after he punched you. Punched you. You tried to leave Richmond without him. In his time of need, you distanced yourself. Gabe had him bramp. Uh, had to brain his own father after David turned. Kate was lo Oh, okay, so it's every character. Okay. Loving. Okay, so we really... We really were close. Okay. Your experience with Gabe was safety first. Oh, I, I love this. This is sick. You ex upset Gabe by not staying in the trailer for the night. You told Gabe the truth about his neighborhood friend. You helped Kate save Richmond before going after Gabe. The New Frontier story. In the end, Trip saved your life on the overpass despite you not choosing him to be saved. You left Eleanor at Prescott Junkyard. You went El Then Eleanor informed Joan about your plan, but you forgave Eleanor for betraying you to Joan. These are characters I've lost along the way. Yeah, I lost all these people. Okay. So, I so I wonder what would have happened if um we would have not chosen to kill Lingard. That's really that's really a interesting thing I think about. Kind hmm. of lost a lot of people, didn't I? Conrad. Okay, so. I shot Conrad, of course. So, uh, 
Jesus, I wonder if you if you could have lost him. Or he would have not come back, sorry. Yeah. Joan. Oh, currently Joan's whereabouts are unknown. No. Okay. And then, obviously, Clint was killed, which I'm still pissed about. Yep, okay, so that's... See. Yep, for some reason. Okay, I love that. So why... I don't get something with Clem, though. That's kind of bumming. That bums me out. Yeah, okay. Why don't I get something with Clem? That hurts my feelings. Okay. Okay, folks. Oh. What is this? It's Clementine. Look at her. So proud. Look at that. Okay. Is there anything else? No. Okay. Wow. What an ending. Well, ladies and gents, you have it. That was episode one through five. Look at that. Wow. So, Clementine's story will continue in... The next episode, we are going to be, be beginning The Walking Dead, the final season. And just like it sounds, it is the final. It is Clementine's final story. Or, I guess, you know, anyone. So, I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know down below what you thought about this game. Let me know what you thought about the writing, if you agreed or disagreed with me. I'm curious to see what you guys thought about it. But in the end, it all leads to the same road, which is going to be Clem looking for AJ. So, as I said, let me know down below what you think about it. And as always, folks, have a nice day.